Hey, what's up? It's me, Mr. Chris Mad, here with a State of the Visnomatic address, because the alliteration doesn't work, because that's the VGA thing. What's going on, everybody? Today is a very um, important update. This isn't really like a monthly update. This is like Visnomatic update. So, to put it blatantly, Visnomatic is truly, truly going to change now. Everything that you know about Visnomatic, everything that we do, the style of our content, uh, the upload schedule, everything is going to change. However, it's still going to be there. So that's basically what today is about. This is going to be kind of like, I got a little bit of a script, but most of it is just going to be coming off my head. So... What's really happening? Um, Visnomatic for now, uh, almost seven years, has been making a video almost every single day. For the first five years, every single day. We limited it down uh, two days. Mondays and Tuesdays were taken off. And we realized that even with less videos, the content just felt like filler. I just felt like we were just making content the fill towards the time to make better projects. And I have been struggling with that for many years now. Um, literally from the start, there was just endless amounts of just like filler content. Ideas of filler content doesn't mean that they were bad content. It would be stuff like um, we were there, we were here too. That game literally was recorded in like summer of last year and it finally came out in January. The point of what I'm trying to say is, I don't want to do that anymore, and neither does any Visnomatic member. Um, this was a conversation. We had two to three meetings about this, basically, trying to figure out what we want to do with the channel. And it became kind of unanimous, pretty much, that we're going to stop doing daily uploads. Daily uploads are going to end. Uh, on May 1st and technically already hasn't been daily uploads we've had Mondays and Tuesdays off as like kind of filler days if we want to do something but the point of the matter is is that this isn't about um, trying to reach some kind of unnecessary quota basically the the problem that we kept having is that no matter how many videos we made it wasn't any growth there wasn't many views on those videos People weren't enjoying them, and they were waiting for the next, like, thing they wanted to watch. And to be honest, some of those gameplay videos I didn't even like. Um, some of them just kind of were videos, and we made them, and they were okay, but they weren't, like, content. They weren't really videos that you could, you know, oh, I'll go rewatch that. No one was going to go rewatch episode 14 of a Let's Play. Um, that being said, it's still, um, gaming related. Everything that we do is either like some kind of gaming related thing, at least to some kind of sector of it, but we're going to be very experimental. I mentioned this in the last update, but now I'm, now we're open about it. Um, you know about our new member, Eleanor, uh, there, um, she is another new member to help our, um, Twitter followers and help our community growth. Um, now that we've got our team as what it is right now, I'm very happy with it, and I think that we can start actually changing how we are. Now, there, there's going to be a small break, basically. It's going to be in May. Um, I really don't know how long it's going to be. It might not even be a week. I'm, I'm very, like, I want to make stuff already. But May having a break would be nice for us to be able to take the time to really make the content we're talking about. Now, what does this mean? Basically, I'm saying that there's not going to be an exactly set schedule. Um, you kind of just expect videos from us, basically. So around 1 o'clock usually, which is how our uploads have always been, but we might change that time too. There should be a video. If there isn't, sorry. But to be honest, there's probably still going to be a half a lot of um, content. There's a hefty amount. But don't expect it to be like a bunch of parts. However, 
That doesn't mean like shows like Sit Down are going away. It's just going to be a little bit different. So say, for example, Enter makes a series. We've always had this issue where like I tell them, yeah, what you're going to do is that you're going to be able to like upload it like by daily. So like every other day. Um, but then, oops, we ran out of video space. Uh, we need to move those videos to weekly, which makes it a lot harder to digest as a viewer, which I was fully aware of, but it was almost this un, like, unreasonable necessity, um, unnecessary uh, problem that we just were having. So let's just not do that anymore. So now if Enter wants to make a series and he wants it to come out Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, I will be okay with that. That's going to be our content for that week. And if you guys like that, we'll be cool with that. And we're going to listen to you guys, too. This isn't just, like, a one-sided thing. I just think that our viewers kind of find the same... They, they kind of fall in that same path because, to be honest, the viewers are voting with their views, basically. The videos that are doing well, in comparison, we're not huge, we're not crazy. I'm fully aware that we're not, like, a big channel. Um, but the views that are doing well are the videos that I want to make. So it's good. Some of those videos have been coming out already. They were basically pilot episodes. One of the big ones uh, was Invade the Net, which was a very um, just kind of we just did it idea. But the concept of just going on the Internet and doing something fun um, with your friends, you know, just look up something funny. But then come come forward. We want to kind of go one step further on that stuff so some of our concepts that I don't really want to talk about are going to really be different from other channels that do similar kinds of content but that's not the that's not once again not the only kind of content we're going to make shows no show is really canceled um circuit break is still happening I'm still writing it we've actually got some episodes ready I'm just trying to get more episodes ready because that's actually more like a show it's actually like an actual show content with scripting writing um, pseudo writing it's a lot of improv but that that show is coming after may so it'll be the first couple episodes you should see either at the end of may or the start of the next month after that um dragon ball um xenoverse right we do dragon ball xenoverse we do dragon ball v for us that show is coming to a close it's going to have a few episodes to kind of wrap it all up and you guys are going to be really um I think you'll you'll like what we did with it to kind of send it off in the proper way. But we've got we got to do a few episodes of those left, and then that's done. But they're going to be really well scripted and really well done. That's coming also at the end of May. See, I'm trying to I'm trying to do this like a like a like a direct or something. Um, you know, but it it's not working. So, what's the cool part of this is that we're going to do more streams. That's the biggest thing is that because I had to make all this content and we had to make sure that these videos were coming out, which was a rule set by me, I set that rule, we couldn't do streams because I had to edit those videos. So by editing those videos and then doing the streams and doing all that, we didn't have enough time to do streams. And we didn't have enough time to do podcasts. So in short, we're going to do more streams and more podcasts because of this. So expect some of our content to be highlight streams, right? They're going to be the snippets of our funniest things. We already have some funny clips from just the last couple streams we've been doing. Also a test market. We've been testing things. I hope you guys have been noticing. we have trying to change things up in real time so you can notice it. And that's the whole reason is that everything is going to be in real time. We make a video. It's edited the next day. We'll just release it. That's awesome. Like it's, it's so refreshing to try to play that way. Because I haven't done that for six, seven years. Where we just had the content and it was ready to go. Let's just release it. We would have to sit on projects two months in advance. Just yesterday we released Delta Room. That should have been out four months ago. I mean, it was recorded two months ago, but still. Like, we should be able to just release content when it's ready to go. So, so to reiterate, this isn't happening now. You're still going to get the normal content that you always expect. It's going to be the same videos in the order that you've been expecting them, and they will all finish out. Um, series that we're trying to we're trying to finish series that are running um, that we care about, um, but we're going to keep going with that. I don't know if the main camera went out. Hello, <laughs> main camera. Hello. Hello. 
All right, we're just gonna make, we're, oh, <laughs> hey, what's up? Um, we're just gonna make this the main camera now. Okay. Hopefully that one is okay. All right, so, okay, <laughs> whoops. So, in short, effectively, we're going to um, not really have any changes until the start of May and the end of May. So we're gonna end any series that we had going. One of the biggest ones would be um, Delta Room will finish up, and any any other long-standing series that needs to finish, like Xenosaga, will finish. Um, nothing, nothing um, that wasn't already like put on the wayside. Like we haven't wanted to address them at all. But expect a lot more party games, a lot more cast members that we didn't normally have in episodes. Because that was another problem is that I had to have people who had reliable schedules to be able to put them in episodes. So because we don't have a schedule we can actually get better content. So that's the whole point, is that because we don't have this direct cast, right? We don't have to like, or we don't have this direct schedule. We don't have to like abide by any rules on that, which I made, I made those rules. So in short, Viznomatic is changing. Um, this is real, this is really happening. Um, this is really scary for me because this has been a consistency for me for over seven years almost um so to really change like this is a bit daunting but we're gonna do it and it's gonna be a lot of fun so don't stop watching uh obviously our patreon says daily gaming content so we're going to obviously address that in the next coming months and you will still get that kind of content in the next two months if you want to stop following our patreon because of this change i apologize but if you want to keep supporting us, it's still going to support us. We just have it set for monthly. You will get tons of videos every month. It'll just be at a different rate. Um, but it will be higher quality content for you. We're going to do higher quality content. This means that we can actually cover a game that just came out and then just release it. Like there's, there's going to be a very different mentality about how we approach videos. But there's still going to be a lot of videos. This is what a lot of bigger channels do. Um... They, they just craft their content and then release it. And I want to get into that mentality because, I, to be honest, I haven't been impressed by our own content in a while except for the videos that we took time on, which is all we're going to do now. So, that being said, be very excited for the future. Be very, very excited. we got a lot of stuff coming. Podcasts are coming back. If you notice my look, the look is the generations of Viznomatic. We are... We're going into a new age, and it's a lot. It's really scary. I'm happy with the team that we currently have because it's the perfect team. I think. I think we got everything we need um, to really, really make this work. So I appreciate everybody's support. I pre. I appreciate everyone's past work with Viznomatic. I appreciate everybody. This is the next step. So look forward to it. We are. We hope to see you there. Um, thank you to all the current Patreon members, and thank you to any viewer that's watching this, and any new viewer that happened to watch this video first. I hope you'll watch our old shows. We have literally 2,000 videos in catalog, and none of them are going away. Um, so we're just going to start over, though. <laughs> we're deleting the whole channel. No, we're going to make some new content for you guys that we hope you enjoy. So, thanks for watching. We'll see you on the next one. Got to Okay. This is, this is very nerving. I'm like so... God. I'm excited. Thanks for watching, everybody. Bye-bye!